Yo guys, this is your artist Tolgard and today I will review Atex Mockers. This is a sponsored video, so Atex provided me with these two sets of mockers, so let's check them out. So these markers came in very handy and high quality bags. I received a bigger and a smaller bag with two tip markers, with a bigger broad tip which are really rarely used and a thinner brush tip. I'm using Atex markers along with Copic and Ohuhu markers for years now and I really like them. I was really happy about receiving a full set of skin color tones as you can never have a too big selection of skin tones. And these markers are also very affordable. The set of 80 markers cost around $75, which makes it way less than $1 per marker. The skin color set of 48 markers you can get for around $50, which is also very fair. On the back side of the bag you can also see all the single color tones. And now to test these markers, we have to create the line art first, and therefore I had an amazing idea. So as usual, for marker review videos, I'm deciding to draw something in which where I can use as many tones as possible. And today, I was thinking of drawing Golden Freezer vs Vegeta Blue from the movie Resurrection of F. I think the idea is pretty cool, and now we will see the evolution of the series version. Let's create the line art real quick, and then we will chat again.
All right, guys, there we have Vegeta Blue, drawn in a buff style, and also more in Dragon Ball Z style, which just looks way better, and in front of him we got beaten up Golden Frieza in anger. I really like this idea, with Vegeta looking down on him arrogantly, which also demonstrates his dominance. It's a lot of meaning behind this, if you know the backstory of both, but now I'm choosing the right color tones I need for Vegeta first. I do this before every coloring part, and today you will see how I choose the perfect tones. It's nothing special, but it's very important. So as I already know these markers, I know that they are great and what I can tell you about them is that they are very smooth, not that vibrant, but still very strong and that the brush tip has the perfect strength to color accurately but still easy to color bigger areas. So now I will color Vegeta and then we will talk about these markers. <laughs>
Alright guys, Vegeta is done and he and the aura are looking very good. So the colors are actually very strong, especially the blue tones I use for the aura and for the suit. They blend very well, are very easy to color with and what I say next will maybe surprise you but I fall in love with the white gale pants I also received. With the gale pants I was using before that, I always had some trouble with the ink, but the Atex gale pants are really amazing. I received 3 of them, so they will last me a very long time. Now I'm coloring Frieza. I already choose the matching tones as you saw, and I'm already coloring. Now we will check out this process, I will finish the drawing, and then we will take a look at the final result. Alright guys, we are done and I think this is a very good artwork. Let's talk about the drawing first. So as you can see, we have Vegeta Super Saiyan Blue with an amazing aura looking down at Frieza after beating him up. He looks very buff, arrogant and dominant and Frieza, who also is drawn pretty good, is in anger because he can't believe how strong Vegeta is and that he actually is losing against him with no chance. As for the Atex markers, as I said the colors are very strong, they are great to color and work with. We have a huge color selection, which also have a very good and fair price and I think you can see how good the colors look. I'm using these markers for years and I'm happy that I could now grow my Atex marker color selection. Now let me know what you think of these markers down below in the comments and if you want to get these as well check the info box below for the links to the exact same markers I used today. Alright guys make sure to like the video to show me your support, subscribe if you are new and you can also support me on Patreon if you appreciate my work that would be amazing. I will of course upload this on full time on my real time channel so you can follow my steps very easy in case you want to draw this yourself. The one and only original drawing is now available on Etsy and now you can also download the digital version of my drawings so check out the shop. For commissions message me on Instagram and if your custom drawing fits to my channel I will make a video out of it and mention your name in the video. All the links down below in the info box including the links to the materials I'm using. That's it guys, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next 